All right, guys, I'm Jonathan with Nomadic Cooling, and I'm here to show you the 18 volt electric cable crimper. If you're going to be building an electrical system for your overland rig, or if you're going to be doing this as a business and doing this more often, this may be a useful tool for you. I'm going to make this super simple, super quick video. Let's get after it. Ready? Okay, what I'm gonna show you guys right now is I'm gonna show you what it looks like when it's done. This is four slash zero, four aught wire. It's about the size of my thumb. It's probably the thickest wire that you're gonna use in your overland rig, at least 95% of all um, overland rigs. This is the biggest wire size that they have. Uh, crimping these lugs on can be a hassle, especially if you're doing it in tight spaces or if you're doing a lot of them uh, at once. So let's see if we can make your life a little bit easier. I have this 18 volt one here. It is fully electric. It's got a removable battery. It's, the package comes with two batteries. You plug that in. You can do it upside down. You can do it on the side, one-handed. Most of the time when I'm doing it, I just keep it right there on the table. So I'm going to show you how easy it is to, to crimp for aught wire. Let's go. I'm going to move this over to here. I'm going to do it this way. I'm going to insert my um, 4AW, well, sorry, my 4 aught cables lugs into the wire. Go ahead, put that down. All right, Kenny, I've got my, uh, my size 95, okay, in here. I've got my 4AWG wire, my 4 aught lugs. I'm going to, let me do it this way so you can see it on camera. I'm going to squeeze these two together. By squeezing it together, it opens up the flange, ready? Just like that. I'm then going to crimp right down in the middle uh, down on this 4 aught. Make sure everything's centered. Uh, how's my angle there, Kenny? You got the whole thing? Once I do that, I'm going to press down on the trigger. Ready? Let's go. Okay. Once it's done, you will, you will hear it stop, but then you will see it pick up just a tiny bit. What that allows you to do is to then engage the triggers again. Okay? Once it's, once it's released. Now, once it's done, Kenny, take a look at that crimp all the way around. You see, that only took about five to 10 seconds. If you were trying to do that uh, by hand, it would take you quite a long time, and I'm not sure you're gonna get that tight of a hold on your lugs. Now, when you're doing something like this inside your electrical system that you're driving down the road, this equals to safety because this is not coming apart, guys. The other thing you're going to want to remember is to use appropriate heat shrink on these as well once you're done finished. Now that I've showed you uh, how easy it is to use it, let's go ahead and show you exactly uh, how to use it. So I'm going to come back over to here in the middle and I'm going to show you on the top right here, there's two little tabs. So that allows you to pull out the different size crimpers just like that okay on the back side you can go ahead and squeeze it together you can also pull this which is uh, basically like a neutral right there go ahead put that back in you guys know where the trigger is there's a little light on it Kenny take a look at that the battery allows you to check the battery and then you can uh, take the battery off just like that and recharge it okay remember you can use it upside down you can use it sideways, it's not very heavy. Let's go ahead and take a look what's in the box, Kenny. We got a box, call the bomb squad. That's what everybody always wants to know, Kenny. They say, what's in the box? Kenny, what's in the box? Well, Kenny, let's just show them what's in the box. For this subtle price tag, Kenny, there should be a box, but it should be a golden box. I gotta be quite honest with you. It's not a golden box, but what are you gonna do, Kenny? It's plastic. Inside here, Kenny, sorry, I got my snifflies. Okay, we've got four, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12 different dies. Okay, they go all the way down from 10. Okay, take a look at that. Can you see me right through there? Okay, all the way up to 120. Now, actually this is a 300. So take a look at this guy, Kenny. Okay, right here and right here. I'm gonna go ahead and put that down on the table so that you can see the two different, from there to there. 
if you're not getting enough uh, with this, uh, I'm sure you can buy more dies, but this is basically, you're never gonna need something this big for an overland rig. And if you did, take me camping with you because that's gonna be one sweet rig. Inside, there's an 18 volt charger, a 110 or 220, and then two different batteries that come inside the kit. Super simple, super fast video, guys. If you wanna go further in comfort with a sweet electrical system that you didn't have to use your uh, muscles crimping on for hours at a time while you were building your electrical system, go over to nomadiccooling.com today and get your electric lithium crimper so that you can go further in comfort. Let's go. Bang, bang.